Alright, that works. That works, that works, that works. Right. Okay, that makes me happy. At least we've got a starter base ready to go for this wipe, which should be reasonably safe for a while. Nice. What's up everybody, welcome to the base, as you saw in that little montage little segment, nothing major, managed to get this little shit heap of a base up, we built it in a rock which is pretty cool again, been a long time since I've done one of these, um, my plan for this wipe it is pretty, it's pretty ambitious, I'm pretty excited, I, I was gonna save it till the end but to be honest I, I wanna tell you right, the plan for this wipe is we're gonna build a hotel, a lot of you guys I'm telling, a fucking lot of you said that in the comments of my, one of my last videos when I asked you what you wanted to see on the channel, um, it was pretty mad. So if that is something you want to see, because it's going to take so much bloody time and effort and resources to build a hotel this wipe, um, obviously playing solo and stuff, please drop a like on the video if that is something that you guys are interested in. There is going to be raids this wipe. I want to raid. So if that's something you're interested in as well, um, let me know in the comments. There'll be um, I want to run a shop, a hotel, and raid this wipe. It's going to be it's going to be pretty mad. I'm pretty excited. So we've got the bow. We've got a little base. Haven't got enough cloth yet for a bag. Um, which is okay, not really too big of an issue. We're stacking up a little bit of low grade, not a lot though. I'm actually going to use that and craft one more. And yeah, come morning, come daybreak, we'll go out. Actually, first let's get a pickaxe, and then let's stone up. If I stone up this foundation here, then they can't get underneath this one, because that one's in the way of that. Alright, nice. And then the wood door with the key on it is Gucci. Coming out to try and... I was going to do some farming, but I've just dumped my tools away again because there's that there. Now, I'm expecting there to be a hell of a lot of people here, and I've only got 17 arrows, not a dickens of any armor. But to be honest... Oh, and I've only got 80 health. Great banter. But really, we should maybe be able to, like, pick off a straggler or two. God, this is, this is a lot riskier than I normally play it on wipe day because obviously this is my only bow. Living in the desert, no cloth, which is always great, but we'll see, we'll see. Let's drop him right here. There's one. He looks geared as well. Alright, hit me then. Oh, he got an AK. He got a fucking AK. <laughs> Right, okay. Alright. Banter. I always get the shittest drops and you got a fucking AK. Wow. That's a weird fucking spawn, isn't it? Alright. I've got to try and make my way back to base because i got to make myself a sleeping bag. Right. Now I know how much you all got so triggered when I missed the min no mini game in one of my previous videos recently. So don't worry. I will go out of my way this wipe to make sure that I hit these silly little lights every single time. If I miss one, I do apologise, that is just my retardedness at playing this game, but I do understand your scepticism. They are very good to hit. You get the node so much quicker and you get a lot more resources. Alright, 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 let's get the furnace crafting. That's about all we've got. I'm, I am struggling, guys, basically because I can't get cloth for a bow, it means I can't really PvP very well, so it's kind of proving pretty tricky. But we'll get a furnace in. I have got a little bit of surplus stone, so I might... Yeah, I can leave that one as wood for now, I guess, because obviously they can't get to that foundation. So let's just make a couple of these walls and that one. And then these two will be metal, I guess, one day. And then the base is getting secure. And plus, when that door opens there, you can't squeeze around. So if I leave that door open, it's like a second mini airlock. I'm going to have to put a double door here to be able to squeeze through. But, yeah, that's all good. Some loot there, my dude. Heard that guy fighting. Oh, there he is. Got his foot. Oh, come on. No, why didn't that shoot? Oh, why didn't that hit? I hope that guy dies. Highly intelligent cosmonaut cracking in. Right, we need to get some wood. Oh, fuck, there's a kid. 
Oh, there's a guy. Hit that cactus. Yeah, out of boy. Have you got a bow, my friend? There we go. Oh, it's Benny who killed me earlier. I think this is this is Benny's base just here. So I don't really want to tangle with that, but at the same time, that's all I want to do is wait till he comes out of his base. Let's try and bait him out. There he is. Oh, he's got a fucking revolver? Lad, get out of town. Well, that's what I was trying to bait him out for, and... Alright, I'm out. I'm out. You can keep it, Benny. You can keep it. Alright, guys, because this is... I've got this big plan in mind for this wipe. It's been a weird one in terms of how I'm going to be playing this series, because I am bored. Uh, I won't lie to you, I'm bored of releasing wipe day episode, then like one or two episodes of the wipe, and then a wipe day episode again, and I'm sure you guys are bored too, because it's just not fun. Even though wipe day is the best day in Rust, I'll give you that. I think the thing is, I want to try and make a more padded out series, and I think the way to do that is to not fuss too much about PvP and stuff on wipe day. What we're going to focus on is PvP when it comes, if it comes, if we can see somebody to kill, we'll kill them. Otherwise, I'm going to keep myself to myself today, farm. Today's episode might be a little bit of a slow one. That's just how it's going to have to be. And then after that, we're going to build up and we're going to start branching out the base, get this hotel going. Now, I've built in this area because there's such a flat sort of quadrant of land out here. So that I've got plenty of room to build this bad boy. My issue is... Benny or Bernie or whatever the bloody B name he's got in that base. I'm gonna have to take him out. Now that may or may not have to be tonight before he gets a metal door on because I can hear his furnace cooking away in there. But I need him out of the way so I can build around here. If not then so be it. I'll just have to like late game raid him. But that is definitely the plan because here on this flat land is literally why I built here. So that the hotel can stand here. Hey there's the fucker. There he fucking goes the cock. All right, where you going, lad? He's seen me. Oh, he's brought his revolver out to play. I can't hit him. Oh, I'm dead inside. That's why he was out of the base then. Alright, that's fine. Fuck it. We didn't have loads. We had a bow, but I can craft another. Yeah, I got two furnaces cooking. Well, he's not lost. Where are you going, lad? Using that metal hatchet of yours? A little bit of wood. Never say no. Never... Oh, you fucking bastard. And then there's a guy with a water pipe. Alright guys, so, managed to find us a rad suit, which is pretty nice stuff, because that's kind of like one of the most important things in Rust these days. So I've come to the, what do you call it, rocket site, made us a revolver, got some pipes. I just basically, I don't, like I said earlier in the video, it's no point to me showing you the same sort of white day episodes over and over again. I mean, a lot of YouTubers do it, I do it a lot, and I want to try and shake this wipe up a bit, so I'm going to try and cut out some of the farming and jazz. So I've come to the launch site, got my rad suit on, pick up a load of components and stuff, plus I'm trying to get an elusive rifle body. I've got quite a bit of high quality back at home, just from bits and pieces, because we've managed to find a sugar ton of metal nodes. No stone though. So if I could get like an SMG body or something, that would be really nice. Look, we're already stocking up some bits and pieces. So crafting some meds, and we're good. All right, the beauty, of, I love the rocket launch site. I mean, it's so, oh, there's 19 high quality already, beautiful. It's so unbelievably OP. There's the rifle body, boys. So yeah, so unbelievably OP loot-wise, but it's so good at the same time. Right, what we got in here? Four more pipes, banter. Right, is that everything? Yeah, right, let's go. I really am tempted to just take this home, but I, I think we'll hit the main building up, see if there's anything there. Get up for me, some gears, nice. Let's start looking at getting some sort of ladder hatch. That was a gunshot, all right. 
I can actually craft a P2 with the shit that I've... Fucking that chopper. I don't know. It's going to shoot me, so I've kind of got to be really quick here. Grab this stuff and we're out. Right, there's a couple more bits and pieces. Yeah, I can craft a P2 with what I've got on me right now. Two more gears. Love it. Right, we need to just get out. See if this green box is here. Someone's obviously been here recently. Green box is here. Two tech trash. Alright, go for some C4. Alright. Oh shit, okay. Okay, that's wood armor out the ass. Fuck, what don't I want here? Oh, six gears, holy shit. Right, let's go home. Let's go home. I tell you what, guys, I have never been more afraid making a run back in my life. Thank fucking Christ that the launch site is not far. Get him right, look at that. That is... Oh my god, two crossbows. That is beautiful. Look at all that high qual. Right, perfect fucking start. I'm going to make an AK. You know what? Yeah, fuck it, I'm going to make an AK. Maybe some rifle bullets... How are these furnaces doing? They are looking glorious. Keep cooking up sulfur because we're going to need GP. Get these going. Like I say, guys, as you can see, I can find metal ore in absolute abundance, but it's just stone. So I guess we're going to have to make this whole base out of um, metal, which isn't too big an issue, really. We need to branch out as well, actually, because we do not have the storage space. That chest is full of crap. Alright. Let's get a little bit. Have a let's get a little bit of an addition going here. Look at this. I actually could have put a ladder hatch there, but I'm probably going to put the ladder hatch somewhere in the middle. I can put a double door there, have some more loot chests. This... I'm, I'm really enjoying this this sort of this base design, this sort of thing. When you've got like one of these arch bases, they are so glorious. But I now need to go and get a load of wood so that we can keep these furnaces cranking. Right guys, there is actually another arch rock just here as you can see, and I'm dead tempted to put myself a TC in it if no one's built in it already. I haven't looked at it since wipe, so let's just go and have a dead quick cheeky look. Because I think the big issue with these is, if somebody else takes one near me, plays more hours than me, I am going to be fuck a doodle dude. I don't know though. Alright, it's got a, a... The reason I didn't build in this one is because of this dip here. My base doesn't have a dip like this. Oh, someone's already built in it. Bollocks. That's fucking whatever his name is with base. Can I... Is that twit? Oh. Alright, you can see into this fucking thing. I wonder if I can spear raid. Oh no. No, that's not going to work. What's he got? It's key locked. Fuck, okay. See a bag. Fuck. If I destroy these, that's not going to destroy it. Unless that's got on a twig one. Which it's not. Balls. Okay. If I could... Maybe if I could shoot that out? Because it's weak sign, but then I'd have to get through another one. Why did he have to put a key on this, the retard? I wonder if... I, I don't know. I'm gambling on... Look, you can sort of see that I, it just depends if we can squeeze through that gap at the back there. This area's quieted down a bit now. Lots of people building their... Bit. There he is. Look, there's somebody. Has he seen me? No, I don't think he has. If I go in there, can I get out again? I can... I've got my hatchet, I'll be able to get out, don't worry. Fucking look at those shots. Oh shit, okay. Yeah, oh no, there's his key. Banter, right, let's take that, take that, take that. Oh my god, two more gears. Take the hoodie, I suppose. I don't need anything else, really. Right, let's go home. Yep, fuck it, I'm out. Rip base, because I've got the one key now. No one's building there, hopefully. Although, if I'd shut the door... Oh, I should have shut the door. Maybe I'll come back. I just want to get this stuff home. That's another furnace, boys. That is lovely. Right, so, as I said earlier, that is the intended base location just down there, over that bit, where I want to place this hotel. I'd love to build it in this arch, but I don't think it's really going to give me enough space to do what I want to do. So we'll branch it out over there. Now, the big problem is that guy who's now got a metal door on. Oh, oh shit, they must have got two! Two signals, sugar, right. That could be worthwhile going to, but I need wood now. I need wood. A foundation on there. See, I, I don't really want to pump all of my resources into um, this base, because obviously I want to put them in the, in the hotel, obviously. But the thing is, I need a safe base that's going to survive the white, that's going to be able to hold all of my loot. 
because if we want to start charging people, obviously we're going to want to charge people for this hotel usage. So we, for that, we need to have a place to store the loot when they bring it. So we got that on. This is no, in any way, sh secure whatsoever. This bit is. Um, so we need stone, and we need some some more wood, and we need some more metal. That is all Gucci. All right, I think, guys, I'm gonna end the episode there. I know it's been a little bit of a slower one, a little, uh, not literally slow. It's been pretty fast paced, but it's been a different kind of white day because I didn't want to show you the same sort of stuff as I, as you guys keep seeing from me. I know you guys are getting bored with it. I'm getting bored with showing you the same stuff. I want a decent wipe. So I think if I spread the episodes out a little bit more, shorten them down a bit, I can bring you some prime quality content. That's the plan for this wipe. So. What I'm going to go do now is I'm going to farm up a load. I need to be able to call this base home, so I need to like put a second story on this bad boy so people can, I can put some loot up there, use that ladder hatch and stuff. Maybe make sure that I can put as many doors as well, because obviously right now this is still a four rocket raid if they come in through this bit, which they would, let's be honest. So we need to secure that, put a roof up there. Now, what I'm going to be doing is gathering up as much stone, as much wood and everything as I can so that we can start this hotel. Like I said earlier in the episode, drop a like on the video if that is something you want to see. So many of you said it was. So I hope you guys are hyped for that. I'm fucking, I can't wait. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hit the like button, subscribe if you're new around here and you're interested in seeing a hotel or interested in seeing any sort of solo survival, duo survival stuff. We do a lot of it here on the channel. Thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you all in the next video.